हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल आई एम डॉक्टर हिमांशु गुप्ता एंड इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस ग्लूकोनियोजेनेसिस सो व्हाट इज ग्लूकोनियोजेनेसिस ग्लूकोनियोजेनेसिस इज द प्रोसेस ऑफ फॉर्मेशन ऑफ ग्लूकोज फ्रॉम नॉन कार्बोहाइड्रेट सोर्सेस दीज सोर्सेस कैन बी ग्लूकोजेनिक अमाइनो एसिड लाइक एलानिन विच इज द मेजर कॉन्ट्रीब्यूटर लैक्टेट प्रोपायोनिल को ए which comes from the metabolism of odd chain fatty acids propionyl coa comes from the metabolism of odd chain fatty acids and glycerol so what happens in gluconeogenesis gluconeogenesis is the reverse of glycolysis in glycolysis glucose is converted to pyruvate but in gluconeogenesis pyruvate will be converted to glucose so as we have discussed in glycolysis there are three irreversible steps in glycolysis so these steps cannot be catalyzed <coughs> by the enzymes that are used in glycolysis so these steps are catalyzed by the four enzymes which are as follows glucose 6 phosphatase fructose 1 comma 6 bis bisphosphatase pyruvate carboxylase phosphonyl pyruvate carboxykinase so now i will show you how pyruvate is converted to glucose so first friends pyruvate enters mitochondria pyruvate enters mitochondria and it is converted to oxaloacetate with the help of enzyme pyruvate carboxylase <coughs> this process requires ATP as well as carbon dioxide remember all the enzymes which require carbon dioxide have biotin as their cofactor all the enzymes which require carbon dioxide have biotin as their cofactor now pyruvate is converted to oxaloacetate <coughs> which enters Krebs cycle so in Krebs cycle oxaloacetate along with acetyl CoA forms citrate citrate is converted to alpha ketoglutarate <coughs> which is further converted to succinyl coa succinyl coa is the step where propionyl coa enters succinyl coa is the step where propionyl coa enters and succinyl coa is converted to mallet now this mallet will be transported out of the mitochondria through the mallet transporter and the rest of the processes will take place in the cytoplasm now the mallet will be converted to oxaloacetate and this oxaloacetate will be acted upon by an enzyme called phosphonol pyruvate carboxykinase it will be acted upon by the enzyme phosphonol pyruvate carboxykinase which will form phosphonol pyruvate As you remember, the this step in glycolysis is catalyzed by the enzyme called pyruvate kinase. Pyruvate kinase. <coughs> now, in order to form pyruvate to phosphonol pyruvate, we have to undergo this process. The oxaloacetate is 
further converted to mallet mallet is transported <coughs> outside the mitochondria where it is converted to oxaloacetate and oxaloacetate is converted to phosphonol pyruvate rest of the steps will be same as in glycolysis phosphonol pyruvate will be converted to 2 phosphoglycerate 2 phosphoglycerate will be changed to 3 phosphoglycerate Three phosphoglycerate will be changed to one comma three by phosphoglycerate. Which will be converted to glyceraldehyde three phosphate. will be converted to glyceraldehyde 3 phosphate now glyceraldehyde 3 phosphate dehyde along with dihydroxy acetone 3 phosphate will be converted to fructose 1 comma 6 by phosphate now here we come to another step which is catalyzed by an irreversible enzyme no here we come to another step which is an irreversible reaction so this step will be catalyzed by an enzyme that is solely found in gluconeogenesis so this is fructose 1 comma 6 by phosphatase by phosphatase <coughs> fructose 1 comma 6 bisphosphatase or by phosphatase and it will result in the formation of fructose 6 phosphate now fructose 6 phosphate will be converted to glucose 6 phosphate and glucose 6 phosphate will be further converted to glucose now this is another irreversible reaction in glycolysis which in gluconeogenesis is catalyzed by glucose 6 phosphatase ok friends so here now we have discussed all the four enzymes which are used in gluconeogenesis glucose 6 phosphate fructose 1 comma 6 bisphosphatase pyruvate carboxylase and phosphonol pyruvate carboxykinase now I would like to tell you some important points about this glucose 6-phosphatase enzyme. This enzyme is now <coughs> predominantly found in liver. It is absent in muscle and adipose tissue. Muscle and adipose tissue. This is a very favorite question of the examiner. So, do remember it, glucose 6-phosphatase is absent in muscle and adipose tissue. And other important point that you have to remember that biotin is the cofactor for the enzyme pyruvate carboxylase. And <coughs> lactate can enter directly through pyruvate. Fatty acids will be metabolized to acetyl-CoA and acetyl-CoA will then enter the Krebs cycle. Propionyl-CoA. 
हाउ प्रोपायोनल कोए फॉर्म्स सक्सिनाइल कोए प्रोपायोनल कोए फर्स्ट कन्वर्टेड टू डी मिथाइल डी मिथाइल मेलोनल कोए फर्स्ट कन्वर्टेड टू डी मिथाइल मेलोनल कोए एंड देन इट इज कन्वर्टेड टू एल मिथाइल मेलोनल कोए एल मिथाइल मेलोनल कोए इज फर्दर कन्वर्टेड टू सक्सिनाइल कोए एल मिथाइल मेलोनल कोए इज फर्दर कन्वर्टेड टू सक्सिनाइल कोए रिमेंबर दैट दिस प्रोसेस इज कैटलाइज बाय विटामिन बी ट्वेल्व एंड इन द डेफिशेंसी ऑफ विटामिन बी ट्वेल्व एल मिथाइल मेलोनिन कोए इंक्रीजेज इन द ब्लड सो दिस इज कैटलाइज बाय द एंजाइम मिथाइल मेलोलिन मिथाइल मेलोनिल कोए म्यूटिस मिथाइल मेलोनिल कोए म्यूटिस सो फ्रेंड्स दिस वॉज ऑल अबाउट ग्लूकोनियर जेनेसिस होप यू लाइक माई वीडियो एंड थैंक यू